itself. So let's see, this one, Zygo versus DB. Olimar, notorious for being a low tier character, and Luigi, more like a low mid to mid character. Mm. Both characters, Olimar sort of has like a little bit of an advantage because Luigi's kind of a slippery character, and he's really fast, but most of his approaches are very linear. Olimar has a lot of disjointed hitboxes that wall players out relatively effectively. I mean, they both kind of have their own projectiles, but I mean, obviously Olimar has more variety with his Pikmin. Yeah, usually the ones that he likes throwing out are whites and purples. Yeah, White? that's what I was going to say, whites and purples, because that's still the same meta in um, Smash 4. Because purples are heavy damage and, uh, and have more knockback. Uh, yeah, purples give out actual knockback, whereas whites, while they are frail, they can actually uh, explode on, like, death. Oh, wow. And you can actually combo off of it. So once you lash up for white Pikmin on, you can grab them, and then time it so that white explodes and then you can follow up after it. That's such a shame for Luigi to die like that. He seemed to be doing at least okay. Wow, he still has a really long uh, wave dash, doesn't he? Luigi has one of the best wave dashes in the game. I think the best wave dash. Yeah. Next being, oh my god. <laughs> That's like an entire platform distance. Oh my god. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> but Luigi's mobility relies heavily on wave dashing. Wave dashing does have a startup. And Luigi's air mobility is actually not that great. I assume that's the same in Smash 4. Uh, Luigi's mobility? Luigi's mobility in the air. Oh, um, yeah, he's he's still, like, I would I think a fastballer. Well, not a fastballer, but um, he still has great mobility in the air and everything. Yeah. But Luigi is heavily ground, ground reliant, but a lot of his combos are also air reliance. Yeah. So he has to position himself every, like above his opponent, but using the ground to do so. Oh, that is a shame. Oh, he's still going to be able to make it, right? No. Oh, and just to add insult to injury. He was still going to make that. He would have protect, he would have been fine. He's back, he's back, but he wanted to play Netflix. Ah, yes. Another one, another weakness of Olimar. His recovery is probably the worst. Did he do that? I was going to say, did he do that out of shield, but no? So, that's actually a frame trap. If you if you jab someone's shield, you have just enough frame like frames to use an up B to punish them for any like option. Nice. It's like um when when Smash 4 you have characters that have like auto canceled aerials and then just jab. <laughs> Basically kinda like that. Jab. Like ZSS neutral air jab. Just to make it safe, but also to catch people off like pressing buttons. Wow, that uh, up air to back air combo is quite nasty. <laughs> Looks like Sammy's just really just wave dashing in and out to force him to do something and then uh, punish Standard him. Standard Luigi! Punish him, yeah, punish him for his lag. Oh, he almost got that ground spike too, him. yeah. I think he did, maybe. Because he read, he used the up smash to cover the roll in. Like oh, right, Luigi's down air is actually really, really good. Especially Yeah. Also, I don't think Chevy is going to Olympus. I think I'm the only Pacific Northwest player going. Ooh, that neutral air actually killed off the top at 137. Wow. What? I see. Which one? I think it's fastball, right? Yeah, it's like him, auto, and oh, uh, uh, ice, ice. Basically, all of the good Smash players. Who wants to go? Probably Chevy. Chevy would probably want to go. That's what we do. We all pile into one vehicle and just go. Hey, carpool, most exactly. efficient. Exactly. I mean, the HOV lane is just so convenient. Yeah, that, ooh. just approaching with jab is just so scary. Also, what you see, convenient. what you see Zygo doing a lot is just reversing his momentum with his uh, whistle, kind of like that. Ah, and it can, you people. can you reverse your momentum that way? Yes, it's B reversing. That's oh. in Smash Four too. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. No! I just didn't oh, okay. know that you could do that with whistle. 
That's insane. Yeah, a lot of moves that shouldn't be, be that can't be be reversed in Smash 4 actually are be reversible in this game. I think it's still be reversible in Smash 4. I just don't remember. I know, it's like I couldn't do that with. I, I know I couldn't do that with Falcon Punch, and I was like really upset. <laughs> nah, I would be upset too, because to be able to be reversed that. Do you just be run Falcon forward punch. at high mock speed, <laughs> reverse your momentum with Falcon <laughs> Punch, and then like 360 degree turn? Oh man. I, I think, uh, do you remember, I don't know if you ever saw, but, um, Zero and Mew, uh, Mewtwo King would, like, play Captain Falcon against each other, and they would try to, like, Falcon punch oh and stuff. Oh my god. Oh, it's so funny. <laughs> they did that on stream once, and it was, like, the hypest thing ever. Alright, so, a stage with less platforms. I don't know whether I agree with this. Considering Luigi's... Woof! Ooh, I thought he was going to die. Olimar was notorious for being a lightweight character. Yep. Wow, that wave dash on the platform is just very well timed. Looks like Zygo can't get anything started right now. So what character? Good lord, he just walked up and dared. Like you're like, oh that that gets me a stop. Bear's actually relatively safe on shield because it has Really good ISA frames that you can just cancel in the air. ISA? ISA. Interruptible as soon as. Ah, okay. Wow. Okay. Right now, Zygo is tilted. That's never a good time to be tilted. Especially against Luigi, where his weirdness can actually just like completely dominate you. Especially similar to like Game & Watch. Wait, no, he's out of Pikmin. Yeah, he does seem kind of forced out of the situation, but... Uh-oh. Yep, that's it, isn't it? No, oh, he still has... Uh, uh, he's still fine. He has some interesting recovery options. It's, it's uh, interesting. Unfortunately, all of Mars recovery is, like, really bad. <laughs> Probably the worst in the game. Wow, I didn't see him pick up the yellow. I thought he... Well, he got the blue. Uh, See, oh yeah, I was gonna see if he was gonna punish for that, uh, for that missed, um, uh, wave dash, cause he air dodged, like, right above him. I don't know if he was doing that in terms of being afraid of an option, but, uh, I if think Olimar didn't still up, landed, but... Yeah, but if Olimar didn't pick up a stock there because of, from that punish, I would've been disappointed. So, kudos to Zygo. Uh, two whites, that's not what you wanna see. That's what you wanna see, though. <laughs> the big old purple. That's what we need. Mm. Right now with only okay, just picked up a couple more. That is the weirdest angle I've ever seen that set. Oh. Yeah, Washington does need more representation for PM. We don't travel a lot. We might travel to SoCal eventually sometimes, but. Not very often. Ooh, body him. Ooh, nice. <laughs> that that up smash was scary. Yep, frame trap right there. The same thing as before, jab. Double aerial. Double aerial. Oh, ah, okay. The winner is Luigi. Luigi. Aerial can come out twice on Shokan. 